Hey guys, welcome to James Penny Technology. Today, for tips and tricks number two, I will be showing you how to record your Apple devices screen with QuickTime Player on a Mac. But before we start, this video is made possible by Forte Audio. At the checkout, enter the promo code James5 to get 10% off any Forte product. So let's begin. First thing you'll want to do is connect your Apple device with your Lightning cable which it would probably it'd be a lightning cable if the device is supported well i'm using an ipad mini 2 for this so connect your device to your mac this may work on windows but that's what i'm using is a mac so it's going to work for me so as you can see by default it's going to open up and show my hd webcam First time record click on this and I'm gonna select iPad. So it's gonna wake up my device. Alright, it's just adjusting my iPad's in portrait mode. Alright, I'll put it back into landscape. So as you can see it resizes it. I'll fix that. There we go. And I'll lock myself in. Alright, so we'll just do a quick test of performance. So I'm going to open up, let's see, we'll open up Angry Birds and do a quick test. Hit record. So, I'll just still explain this. So, yeah. This feature um, would be useful for some people, others, it's just that uh, if you want it, you don't want it, well, it's just always there in case you do. But, pretty much, you can record what you've got on your iPad screen. So, maybe you're a mobile gamer, you want to record, so you could open up QuickTime and record your screen maybe playing a mobile game or something racing a shooter but yeah if you're playing a shooter or something like this where you you need to activate abilities or maybe in a shooter you'd have to try and kill an enemy look at your device's screen do not look at the computer as it lags behind and it's going to be harder to keep track because you're going to look up and it might have froze and you look back down your device you'll say you have died or something like that <laughs> I, haven't I haven't got any so I'm not going to show you anything so yeah I'm just going to go home and see there's a bit of lag so yeah it works okay I'm going to open the app store and go in there go home so yeah, this is a useful feature, we'll just quickly play back the video. Mass and fluid. However, yeah, if it does freeze, it's going to... Um lose your progress and you're not going to want that so it it sometimes lags you're going to want a, a bigger battery like a battery that maybe is charged has a lot more than this because five percent is not going to last a lot with recording and especially visit video editing that kind of stuff so make sure you haven't got that many apps open just conserve the batch. So this has been just a quick tips and tricks video. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe.